All right, so last time you saw me, I was uh, getting ready to take the car out on a test drive. I was getting ready to mount the cameras and all this stuff, pulled the car out, and what ended up happening was it started raining. Florida. So I pulled the car back in, parked it, and you know, since then, uh, off camera, I've been driving it around, braking in the motor, driving moderately, not hard, uh, tuning it a little bit, at least in vacuum, and so far it runs good. Motor is broken in, it got a good 90 miles on it. Should be good enough. Got my buddy Alvaro here. So we're gonna put the hood on, so I don't have to worry about it raining and possibly screwing up any electronics. Uh, I've heard that it's not really a big deal. I've seen cars get, you know, drive at the drag strip and stuff. Started raining, nothing happened, but I don't want to take any chances. I've already spent too much money as it is. So let's get the hood on and then we'll take it for a drive. Right, guys so we're gonna take it out for a drive we're gonna start tuning it the motor is broken in we've got let me check 88 miles that's good enough typically I'd take it to 100 miles but you know we're close enough um, when you're breaking in the motor you want the rings to seat so you drive it nice you drive it moderately don't drive it super easy you know but once you get the basic tune going you just kind of drive moderately moderately and you're good to go so what we're gonna do we're gonna start tuning the fuel tables uh, the ignition tables I'm gonna leave for a dyno day the previous engine's ignition table should be good enough. We've only dropped the compression a point, so I don't think it's gonna negatively affect ignition that much. I'm, I'm gonna have to probably advance the timing a little bit in some places, but for now it's okay. I just wanna tune the fuel table, um, which is probably a little more relevant right now. So I could tune everything myself, take logs and do all this stuff and adjust the fueling, but um, or at least the volumetric efficiency in Megasquirt's case. But uh, Tuner Studio, which is the software used to tune Megasquirt, has this really, really nifty feature called Auto-Tune, or Tune Analyze Live, as they call it. And uh, what it does, it analyzes the uh, input that it's receiving from the air-fuel ratio and compares it against the air-fuel ratio table that you've specified, and it adjusts the fuel or the volumetric efficiency up and down to help the, um, the engine meet those targets. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to drive around, uh, get it up into boost, you know, tune it, and uh, we're going to go from there. So... Uh, let's go for a drive. Okay, so I tuned it on wastegate, low boost setting, looks like about 10 PSI. We just turned on the boost controller and we're going to run it for 15 PSI. So uh, we should be good to go. Uh, Alvaro, just go ahead and hit uh, start auto tune and we'll start doing that. smooth it gets kind of I, I feel a lot of vibration above 7,000 um, but I guess I don't know I don't see any problems with it uh, maybe I need to play with the ignition maybe I need to play with the fueling but so far so good So that 
was a great run. No problems whatsoever. Uh, just had to let it tune, let the auto tune figure out what should be the appropriate VE value for RPM and load. Everything runs great. Everything seems fine. It didn't have any major issues. Was able to rev all the way out to 7,500. Hopefully soon I can get on a dyno and get all of the ignition timing dialed in. So right now, Alvaro uh, already went home. He's getting some dinner real quick with his wife. And then we're going to run down to his house and I'm going to jump in his car. We're going to go down to Mana in Wynwood, the Mana Convention Center. He told me that there's like a car meet or car show, like some big car thing that's going on there. So let's do a quick time warp and let's jump over there. So we're here with uh, with Alvaro. We got night night vision turned on because it's kind of dark here. Uh, so yeah, we're just stopping to get some gas real quick. So we're and then we're going out to the car show over in Winwood. Uh, you know, I was looking up. I couldn't find any any car shows in Winwood tonight. I guess maybe I just I just googled real quick. I didn't really find anything. Street racing made safe. Oh yeah, they're having yep. a thing. That's their thing. Yep. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. All right. We hope we're going there. Damn it. Uh, the stupid Miami traffic. So here we are in uh, this is Alvaro's Dodge Challenger and we're just exploring the limits of grip here on the highways of Miami. <laughs> uh, watch it, cops. Alright, good news, we have escaped the clutches of Miami traffic. We've taken the exit and we're well on our way. Are we gonna make it in time, man? Because this thing you said this thing is at midnight? It's, it's already kind of late. It is late. I don't, I don't know if we're... May not. Uh, we'll, we'll do it anyway. Full send. Alright, we made it. Alright. Doesn't look like there's that many people left, but eh, it's worth checking out, I suppose. Yeah, you got a skyline out here. There's Mario's Focus SD, I think. Oh, cool. Let's step out and uh, park up, step out, and let's see uh, what can we do. All right, so the parking lot's kind of empty, but technically <laughs> we made it. So, I mean, whatever. There's still a few cars here. We can just check them out. Yeah, I like how there's somebody playing fuck the police while the police are here. Yeah, yeah, you shouldn't be doing that. Yeah, that's kind of, that's, that's how you get your ass kicked, bro. All right, all right, what's, what's, what is this? This is a uh, BMW. It's kind of nice. What is this? There we go. Wait, 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 wait. Take a video of this. Take a video of what? Dump it, dump it, dump it. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. All right, all right, go. And then dump this one. Look at this. Damn, now it's hard parked. Shit. You got Ronnie, go oh, you got, you got another one? All right, one all right, hit it. it. Sorry, man. Ronnie, go ahead, Ronnie. What do you got, Bluetooth on air? You can do that now? Bro, that's what happens. You you're you're supposed to have it set up beforehand. You gotta be ready, you gotta be ready. <laughs> Alright, any, any day now, come on. Any day now. Kenny, Kenny, come do it, come do it. What's going on here? So, you, don't, you, don't, you don't have the switches? You can't just hit the switches and hit the hydros, hit the hydros, make it three wheel motion. Oh, there you go. Now 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 we're talking. There we can, you, can you still drive like that? I think you can still drive like that. You, I think you can drive. Cause you're not you're not hard parked like him. Like you drive like that, you're gonna screw up everything. You know, you're gonna break everything. But I think you can still drive with your car all the way here down. Hey, what's up, Mario? What's up, dude? What's up, man? How you doing? You're on the you're on the channel now. All right, there's a really really nice R33 here. I want to check out before we leave. Looks like most of the cars are leaving. There goes Mario. So uh, I don't want to call it a waste of a trip, but yeah, whatever. It's, it's always fun. So let's take a look at this R33. All right, R33 Skyline. Yeah, man. I, What's I, up, brother? I hit a cat on the way here. You oh, hit a cat? That's no. Why, no, it was a dead cat. Uh, oh, shit. Race car Kev, who built my car, um, I, was, I was following him to the meet. Yeah. And his car is a little higher than mine. So I didn't see I didn't see the cat, obviously, and I didn't see him jerk. So 
I was trying to move out of the way. Yeah, but when I tried to move out of the way, it was another car taking a picture, so I couldn't turn. You couldn't move. Oh, it was oh, oh, oh man, oh, man. It's, it's good, man. It's, it's, the time, time, it's time for a veil side kit now. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> is this a GTR or is this a, like a GTS? Oh, no, it's a GTR, man. Oh, sick. Yeah. Dude, you got to go all the, all, all the way. Always yeah, get a GTR. GTR. Yeah. I feel you, man. I oh, a, man. Yeah. Oh, that's so yeah, messed yeah. up. But you know what? It looks like... The radiator support looks like nothing else got bent. Uh, intercooler looks okay, so that's good news. Just needs a. Oh, you know what? I think he just needs a he needs a lip. Okay, this is like yeah, it's plastic. So. Hey, you know what? It looks like your bumper and intercooler survived. So I think if you just get a, a new lip, you should be yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. My, my intercooler sits high. And yeah. The bumper, so it's all good. And plus, with the GTR, is the bumper is like half down. Yeah. And you got the um the little. Yeah, the hat is just half lip and half bumper. Yeah. Yeah. So all right. Good man, it's gonna survive. You know, it's the it's the. It's cool, the bro. Definitely. Looks yeah. good, man. I love it in white, man. It looks really good, man. I'm trying yeah. to. Uh, I'm almost done. I did the uh, R35 seats in the back. Oh, so shit. a lot of people don't well, know. You can do that? Oh, well, nice. No, we did a we did a replica. So my okay. buddies at E3 Upholstery, they did the Alcatara swing. E3 everything. does good shit. Yeah, those my buddy Eric, Matt, you know Christian. Shout out to them guys and whatnot. But That's yeah, so they cool. did the whole interior to the car. Nice. Yeah, man, it looks real nice, though. Yeah, man, you dude. you fit in it not too bad. I mean, you're you're a pretty big dude, but hey, no no biggie. Yeah, I mean, you want you want to sit in it? You? Oh, for sure. Here, can you hold the camera? Yeah, yeah. We're actually gonna do some uh, custom brackets on the bottom. Well, you'll definitely be able to fit in. Oh, dude. I'm like, I'm, I'm about as tall as you, but like a little bit narrower. Oh, dude. This chairs are comfortable. Yeah, there's plenty of room. Yeah, there's plenty of room. I look like a baby sitting in the car. <laughs> you. you know? That's coming to chair. Yeah, the chairs. Yeah, the chairs. You know what it is? You, you got long legs. Yeah. You know, but we're about the same height, but you got long legs. But the thing is with the R34, I mean, um, 33, and even the driver's side, is the, the driver's seat is like elongated. But we're gonna put some custom brackets to make it lower. You got boost here, you got... Nah, actually, that doesn't even work. None of those gauges work. So the one that works is the boost gauge right here. Oh, you got the Temperature gauge, yeah. Dude, these alone are like 1,200 bucks. Yeah, so wow. I got that, um, the Elite 2500. Oh, sick, dude, yeah, that's one of the best ECUs. Yeah, so um, nice. single turbo, got the radium surge tank in the trunk, but uh, I'm gonna replace the, um, the fuel lab pump and then go with two uh, separate pumps. Two so pumps? Yeah, yeah, nice. Pressure kept dropping, so I'm thinking we're gonna get about 800 right now. with 565. But okay, okay, that's on pump. Not bad Can at I all. Jump in real quick. Go ahead, go ahead. But the thing that's killing me right now, though, because I haven't driven the car in a while, is the clutch. Is the OS guy can triple this. Oh, yeah, so. that's gonna that's good. That takes some getting used to. <laughs> yeah, it's almost like a button on and off, oh, right? Oh man, yeah, yeah. So stall, stall, stall. Well, not anymore. I just gotta drive the bitch like, a, like I'm racing. Excuse my language. I just gotta drive like that's I'm racing. That's all right, that's all right. But half the time I'm not racing, I just gotta rub the RPM, so. Got the suede interior. I like it. It looks good. Yeah, man. it looks nice. Shit. Bro. See you, brother. All right, boss, man. I'll take you. You gonna be at the next meet in March or? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll okay. be at the next meet. We'll probably right, see you bro. around. Yeah, it'd nice be, meeting, man. Completed. Likewise, Definitely. man. Follow me on What's IG, your name again? Man. Jenkins. Jenkins 6 on IG. There you go, brother. All right, boss. See you, man. You want the Street Kings? Huh? You want the Street Kings on Saturday? Uh, yes, if I can get my car situated in Dino. Oh, yeah. So, I was there. I was just hanging out. Yeah. Oh, you talking about this past weekend? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, my car was there. We was oh, there. Oh, sick. Yeah, yeah, oh, we cool. was there. Cool. Nice, man. All right, cool, fellas. Man. All right, bud. Catch you later. Have a good night, man. All right, so that kind of sucked. You know, we didn't get to see the the entirety of the show. What happened? What is it, like once a month? Yeah, once a month. Okay, okay. So we didn't get to see the entirety of the show, but I mean, whatever, you know. Sometimes uh, sometimes things happen, you know. I think if we didn't spend as much time tuning the Miata as we did, we probably would have made it here a little bit sooner. But whatever, you know, time flies when you're tuning. Yes. You know, like an hour pass and it felt like 15 minutes. We we're having fun, man. Yeah, we're having <laughs> fun. Uh, so, yeah, we, we got it up. I think I got it to like 13 or 14 PSI. I think what it is, the wastegate spring doesn't allow me to boost pass that much because you can only double the amount of boost that your wastegate spring runs. And even with the boost control turned up to 15 pounds, I'm just not getting 15 pounds out of it. So, new honestly, turbo in the mix, huh? I think I'm probably going to move up getting the new turbo. Uh, I wanted to wait a little bit, pace myself, but this turbo just, if I'm going to really appreciate what this um, new motor can do, I'm going to need to get a new turbo. So, sure. I don't know. Money. It's just money. Just lots of money. Just money. 
So uh, let's, hop, the game. let's hop into the Challenger and see where we're going to go next.